Rick, congratulations on the new four year contract. Uh, you must have been delighted to have it all sorted. Yeah, it is it's great. You know, uh, my first contract was five years, and uh, you know, I've signed it because Leeds is a great club and uh, I want to play here. And it's, I believe it's one of the greatest, one of the greatest clubs in uh, in England and the game itself. So uh, yeah, very happy with the new contract and um, you know looking forward to it now. Look forward to the new season and you know to bounce bounce up and uh, hopefully hopefully win some silverware. When you look around Emerald Headley and, and the developments here, it's an exciting time to be part of the Rhinos. Yeah, it's great. I think you know you don't see stadiums like this often in rugby league and. Uh, you know, it, it looks it looks very good. It looks like an international stadium. You know, with with the big stands and the big lights. So um, yeah, looking forward to playing here next year. And uh, is it's all flying up now actually? So yeah, so I should be ready soon. And a long-term contract as well. Your your the club's shown faith in you, and, and you're returning that. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm grateful for the opportunities and. Uh, it means a lot that you know Kev and and Gary and the staff you know believe in me and uh, they think they think I can do a a job for the club and uh, I can be you know one of the players to play uh, for for a long time so um, I appreciate that and and yeah I am you know I, I want to return the favour by by playing hopefully play my best rugby. And you capped off last year with that Knights call up. Has that whetted your appetite to to kick on next season? Yeah, I mean it's it's a big confidence boost, you know, to go over there with with uh, some great players from from Super League and uh, you know to, to get some uh, great experience over there and uh, not only on the field but you know off the field some life experience that that will stay with you forever. So yeah, it, it was a great way to finish. Uh, it, it wasn't the best year as it for, for the team, but you know, individually for, for me as a person, uh, as an individual, I think think about a year where you know I, I kind of got my breakthrough and uh, I can build on from that now. How much are you enjoying working with Dave Ferner? Oh, he's great. You know, Dave. Uh, he, he came in, and you know, there's a lot of fresh things happening, and uh, you know, a fresh start I think is, is good for everyone because there's so many young players coming through now, and. Um, you know, Dave is great because he, you know, he treats he treats everyone the same, and everyone, you know, everyone's on the same level, and everyone's got the same same uh, chance, you know, to, to get that shirt. So uh, he's he's been working with all the young lads as well, you know, uh, giving us all the help we need, you know, to progress as as the young players, you know, going to the first team. So yeah, so far has been, has been outstanding. And you're the next player of a number of the young players who signed long-term commitment to to the club. Is there a sense that this group of players can can stay together and achieve something special? Yeah, I mean, you know, all all the young lads that I've signed here, you know, their their uh, I think their targets and you know their aims is to, to to play at Leeds and to get yourself on you know on the 200 plus wall, you know, for the players that that played more than 200 games for Leeds at least. So uh, I think. Um, you know, every player wants to achieve big things, and uh, every player wants to, you know, be, be back at the top where, we, where I think Leeds belong. Um, you know, because last year we, we finished where you know, no, I don't think anyone wanted to, to be in that situation. So um, I think that's where that's where we all want to be, back at the top.